your latest news update from Western Mass News. I'm Abby Carnavale with your latest news, including devastating flood leaving its mark around the valley after more than hev more heavy rainfall this weekend. Crews out on the waters at Brunel's Marina in South Hadley cleaning up what's been left behind. Most of the docks have been swept away, flooded and destroyed. And it's been a tough week for everyone there following the tragic passing of Luke Brunel, the owner of the marina on Thursday night and flooding causing more issues as raw sewage makes its way into the Connecticut River. Viewers reaching out concerned about the overpowering smell and potential health risks. According to the Chicopee Water Pollution Control, in cities like Chicopee, Holyoke and Springfield, pipes collecting wastewater and stormwater were built together. Heavy rains can cause those pipes to back up into homes or even streets. To prevent that, the pipes are open to drain into waterways and experts say to avoid water activities in those areas for the next 48 hours after the discharge stops. And crews are working to repair a gas leak in Holyoke at the intersection of South Street and Northampton Street. It happened around, happened around 9 this morning and crews evacuated some homes in the area as a precaution for a short time. Holyoke Gas and Electric officials say one lane will remain open for traffic to flow safely in both directions. They expect the work to be complete by the end of the day. I'm first alert meteorologist Don Maher. Last thing we need around here is more rainfall, but unfortunately that's exactly what's coming our way tomorrow. And because of that flood watch is already up for all of Western Mass beginning at noon tomorrow. These will remain in effect uh, through a Tuesday evening. If you're heading out this evening though, weather is going to be just fine. We will see partly cloudy skies, temperatures which are in the 80s this afternoon, going to dip down into the 70s this evening. Overnight lows mid to upper 60s, a mild and a muggy start to, to our day tomorrow. Sunshine and clouds tomorrow morning, but we're going to watch for showers and thunderstorms to develop as we head on into the afternoon. Couple of stronger storms, not out of the question, but even any storms that are not on the stronger side still could put down some heavy rainfall. And with the rains we've seen the last several days and the grounds already sat, there is that renewed concern that we may deal with some flooding issues as we head through tomorrow afternoon and into tomorrow evening. Tomorrow will be a first alert weather day. We'll dry things out for Wednesday and Thursday, but the chance for more showers and thunderstorms comes on Friday. Stay with Western Mass News on air, online, and on our app throughout the day for breaking news, weather, and exclusive content.